Dude, I'm in a predicament here. What's up? Psybeam two shots me. I can kill with a quick attack, but I'm confused now. Do you have anything on your team that's death fodder? You can get rid of the confusion by swapping into something. Yeah, that's what I just did. I just switched out into Metapod. 12 seconds later. Yo, did, did you sack the Butterfree? No, 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 no. Bug Bite killed. You're Butterfree. Its level one moveset is Bug Bite, Gust, Harden, String Shot, and Tackle. So Bug Bite and Gust are like your only two. But it gets confusion in level eight. And then level 12, it gets all the powder moves. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, if I can keep it alive, it's going to be really good. I'm just trying to think like what to do here. I'm at a head tenna now. A little longer than a few minutes later. It's dead. What's dead? My Metapod. Metapod's dead. Well, there you have it. Roki got the first death. And I still don't know what I do. I still literally don't know what I do here. Boys, girls, cats, girls, what is going on? My name is Lay Salty, and how are y'all doing today? Welcome back to episode four? I want to say four. Yeah, it would be four. Episode one, two, three, this is four. Correct? Yeah, yeah, because the first oh one was on, hold on both of hold ours, on. and then the second one was on yours, and then mine is the third one that we just did, so fourth. So yep. this is fourth, this is fourth. This is episode four, we're going to keep get going with it get it going me and rival roki did some stuff off screen and um like no grinding realistically he ran into a couple trainers trying to get back to where he was um and um we discussed a little stuff off screen i went to go get an item in the wild area and um roki's not happy yeah i would uh i would say i'm pretty salty so pretty much in a second here, my Nidorino is going to, my Nidoran <laughs> is about to evolve into a Nidorino. So I went to get a Moonstone from the wild area. So I'm going to have a Nido King. The second this, this guy, thing evolves. Man, this guy. He's got two fully evolved Pokemon pre-level 20. Three. Like, I I'm, I'm sorry. Three? I have my Gorgeist. I'm going to have Nido King. Oh, and, and Lapras is a standard. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I just meant like fully evolved and stuff. But I guess, yeah, that counts technically. Dude, I've been getting really good with these YOLO balls. Like, every time, man. Oh, it's also... Just, it's just easy. Also, we noticed something that I kind of forgot in the moment when we were in the episode. Um, Hustle is Nidoran's hidden ability, which changes when it evolves into a Nido King into Sheer Force. H has this been confirmed? Like, have you checked this now and it's totally confirmed? Oh, I, I, I have checked this. Nido King doesn't get doesn't have the ability hustle its hidden ability is sheer force and my it, it we'll see it we'll see it in the episode in a second too because my Nidoran is currently evolving into Nido Reno dude I'm like I'm so sad boy right now that that's just like dude I don't even know how I'm gonna get through this first cage match I might honestly just go into it knowing that I'm taking the the L here so the thing is, guys, in case you guys haven't been understanding the rules, what the situation is, is that we go into the gym with our full team. However, the Pokemon we bring into the gym are the Pokemon we have to bring to the cage match, but we only have to bring three of the Pokemon. All the Pokemon that survive in the cage match for the winner, obviously, because one team's going to lose all three and the other team's going to have one, one to three Pokemon remaining. All, all of the Pokemon that remain alive get a one of the three perks, being either TMs, held items, or revive. One of the three. Or they can be re-surprise traded and they don't get a perk. Um, and then the winner also gets to choose one of the loser's three Pokemon that he brought to the cage match uh, to die. It's only from the three Pokemon that he brings to the cage match that they get to choose to die. It's not his entire team. So you know that Galarian Shiny Moltres I got earlier? Yeah. I literally just got it again. The exact same one. Like, literally the exact same one. Unless somebody is, like, trading the exact same one. It's, like, same level and everything. Same name. <coughs> Maybe. Dude, tell me how. I have no clue. So now you got to re-surprise trade it again. Oh, I yeah, so I'm just I literally, advancing. I literally went into the mine and I didn't go get, um, I didn't do anything. I didn't catch my Pokemon, <laughs> so I gotta <laughs> go catch it, because I went back to the Pokemon Center to evolve my Nidorino into Nidoking, um, and teach it new moves. 
Oh, I was like, why'd you go back to the Pokemon Center? You realize there's somebody outside of the mine that heals you, right? No, because I'm remembering moves. Yeah, no, that makes sense, because you're you're stacking your, your Pokemon to be competitively viable. I don't know what you're talking first, about. First cage I am, match. I am definitely not a, teaching a Nido King Earth Power at the Earthquake. moment. Earthquake? Earth Power? Okay, the Earth Power is pretty, uh, um, pretty tight. A modest Nido King with Earth Power with Sheer Force? No. Uh... Wait, this thing to me. <laughs> <coughs> Is it not Sheer Force? Oh, no, I haven't checked that yet. Um, But it told me I get Sludge Wave at level one. Where's my... oh, Is it Sludge Bomb? Oh, no, it's Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl that it gets Sludge Wave. Oh, that's so unfortunate. You can't get Stab Sludge Wave on your Nido King. It's okay. I got Stab Poison Jet. Oh, that's probably better anyway. Oh wait, you're no, not, because you're, I'm no, modest. You're a special attacker. I'm yeah, modest. That's right. That's right. It sucks to suck, doesn't it? I'm literally down in it, in attack. Um, mm. I don't know what I want. So unfortunate, man. Do I just keep peck for now? Do I learn double kick? Uh, I would say that you should teach him tail whip. Uh, defense curl. I don't think it gets defense curl. Nope. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Just, just teach him everything but that. <laughs> don't worry. His move set is not that great. It's only Mega Horn, Earth Power, Toxic, and Poison Jab. That's still not bad. Honestly, that's gonna help you out a lot. Oh no, it's fantastic. I was being sarcastic. Um, and yeah. um, uh, can confirm he 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 does have sheer force. I am so sorry, Roki. I did not. I was sleeping on Nidoran. I'm like, I like the Pokemon, but I was sleeping on him. I completely forgot that Dude, I could Dude, that's get okay, Nidoran. though. Like, you, you think about it, and this is totally gonna happen. Like, so many times throughout the series, you can only assume, like, uh, like we're. I'm just waiting to get, like, oh, I probably wasted that potion. Um, like, I'm just waiting to get something, too, man. So, like, it's, like, at any point, like, I could get. I don't know. I'm trying to think of something crazy like a. Uh... For all we know, you can get a Gen Legendary at level one. Yeah, which, I mean it doesn't you... happen often, but it doesn't. It could. But you can get it, and it's usable technically. Oh, it, absolutely. He's allowed. Absolutely. As long as it doesn't have an illegal move, he's allowed to use it. Dude, I feel like the spin to get your surprise trade to work works literally every time. Ooh. Living like. What's the guy's name? Leon? Larry. Oh, Leon. Larry. Yeah. Leon. Leon. Larry. Yeah, Le yeah. Leon is the thing, but the, the phrase is living like Larry. Yeah. Uh, hey, I got a nether score bunny, so that is dupes. Man, I want a score bunny. Oh, would you like one? Tell you what, here, I'll surprise trade this, and if you get it, you get it, alright? Oh, you ready? Wait, 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 wait. I'm not ready. I only just got my Pokemon to surprise you. I better hurry up, man. Hurry up. Hurry ah. up. We'll do it. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on a second, hold on a second, hold on a second, so... Okay, so hold on a second. Sorry, you might have to, to, to fix that because I just screamed, but... Bro! It has liberal. So I know dupes isn't optional, but can I trade out my score bunny for another one? Is it is it because it's libero? It's not because it's libero, but... It is, it is adamant libero. with high jump kick and sucker punch. <laughs> and it is libero. It's not libero. It is blaze. I will say that. I, I would have literally, like, at that point, I would have just, you know, snuck it in and never told you about it. Uh, you would have no, just been like, like, wait, when did your when did your reboot go from French to Korean? <laughs> even if it even if it is, uh, even if it was it's libero. Uh, no, I'll let it's you dudes. I'll I'll let you swap out your Cinderace for it. Your your reboot. For this court, I don't feel like that's fair. I, I don't feel like that's fair because it I is mean, dupes, and so that's it, basically like me trading it in. It's up to you. I'm fine with it. It's realistically up well, to you. If you want it, I'm trading it. I'm currently surprise trading. All right. Well, you might get it. You might not. Make sure you spin to win on the on the railroad tracks. If I get it, I really hope you don't get my Pokemon. Because I'm send, huh. I'd be sending a Roly Coly your way, dude. I love Roly Coly. I have Earth Power. 
I mean, Roly Coley is still a little cutie patootie. Does your trade complete? Uh, I don't know. I'm in a battle. Oh, well, maybe if you weren't in a battle, you would have gotten this trade. But that's not how it works, Salty. What if I leave this battle? If you get a Roly Coley, I'm sending it to now, Landon. Nope. It's going to Landon. Oh, it's not going to me. I know why. Uh, when I went to the wild area before, I didn't want to lag because I didn't want to waste time, so I turned off my <laughs> I turned off my internet and I forgot to turn it back off. Oh no, <laughs> that sucks. Wait, tell me. Wait, I don't know if this helps me as much as I'm thinking it will, but this might actually be my answer here. I might have just gotten my answer. By the way, guys, we also um, kind of like somewhat revised a rule in um, in the break. Um, we were kind of discussing like what what the level cap uh, rule means exactly. Does it mean that we have to be under level twenty or well, twenty and lower battling the gym leader or not? And we said we would kind of let it slide if we accidentally like we have to go into the gym at level twenty. We can't be higher than level twenty. If it, we are higher than level twenty, you cannot use that Pokemon. However, we are gonna relax a little and let um. Let it slide if we accidentally get above level 20. Like, if we get to level 21 inside the gym. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I feel like one level, like, may like may change it up a little bit. Like, if we would have survived, like, if we would have, like, died versus surviving on one, like, maybe. But I feel like the most part, it's not going to make that much of a difference. Like, the first gym is the first gym. It won't. Are it we... Won't. Are we doing... Are we allowing Dynamax and Gigantamax and stuff in the gym? Yeah, you could you could Gigantamax and Dynamax in the gym, just not in okay. the in the uh, cage lock. It's makes only sense. cage lock that we are not allowed to do it, uh, just because like it's kind of unfair because they can Gigantamax and Dynamax, so like it's kind of unfair if we can't. You know what's unfair? <coughs> My Nido King Lapras and Gorgeist. No, nah, I was just gonna say the fact that like you 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 people are watching this and you're not subscribed to Slightly Salty. And, follow and you, you haven't and liked TikTok. the video yet. And you haven't liked the video. Like, what's going on? Like that video. Show some love. Yeah, come on. Maybe we'll show some love back. Hey. I, I always, I always like like getting to talk to people and stuff in the comment section. Oh yeah, me too. It's always fun. I always try and like, anytime I get like an update, I'm just like, ooh, I want to see what they said and like talk to them and like figure out what's up. So yeah, leave some comments. Let us so know what's up. Let us know how you're enjoying the series so far. I'm not gonna lie, sometimes I'm a little late on the reply, but I usually do reply. Yeah, that's what matters, dude. Just like say what's up. So let us know let us know how your day's going in the comment section down below. My day is going pretty dang okay. My day has not been bad. Obviously, like we're we're still on the same day here, and I had a little bit of like a rough start to my day, but it, it's been a blast just going through like recording and playing the game and stuff and trying to figure out how I don't die to bed, eh? Also, yeah. are you there yet? Are you at the, the bed fight? I'm going up to him. Oh my gosh, what? What? I'm just looking at that, like, I just saw a move that this Pokemon has that I just got, and I'm like, wait. Oh, that doesn't help me as much as I thought. I was thinking something different. <coughs> okay. Also, like, I should probably tell you what I got, right? Yeah. I so, it's going to completely change the game. This might actually be my entire answer to your Nido King here. What is it? It is an Exatu. Ooh, yeah. I mean, I I'm neutral to these two. It's not going to help me that much at all. No, I've got Megahorn. <coughs> oh, well, then it really isn't going to help me at all. <laughs> Megahorn? Is that what it's called? Yeah, Megahorn. Yeah, yeah it's Megahorn. I'm totally it, like... Which uh, is only neutral against you. And it's got an 85% chance to miss. So if you get like extra sensory... I had stored power, and I, I thought it was something different. What one was I thinking of? Oh, I keep thinking I have... This might be a little hard. No, it won't be. Okay. I keep thinking I have Poltergeist on my Gorgeist, but no, I've got Shadow Sneak. Yeah, Shadow Sneak's fire, though. Oh, so yeah, I set up. I did a home calls on my Drillbur, and it like still did like jack. This thing is not great right now. I'm trying to win double kick. Ooh, you're trying to win double kick. Okay. 
Try not to use Reboot has been like kicking my butt, honestly. That's why I've just been like steamrolling with Reboot because it's it's just been easy. And everything like nothing I have on my team can really do a lot. Yeah. Did you end up keeping I mean, even the Cinderace that you got or did you trade that? No, I kept the one I had. It just didn't seem fair. I well, guarantee way, you would have gotten a bunch. Oh, no. Either way, it's it, you do get no. a high jump. Oh, do you get a high jump kick? No, you don't. That's an egg move. Yeah, it's an egg move. <laughs> Dude, I'm in a predicament here. What's up? So, Psybeam two shots me. I can kill with a quick attack, but I'm confused now. So if I die, Ooh. I almost just lost my Jobber there. Um, do you have anything on your team that's death fodder? Because, like, you can you can get rid of the confusion by swapping into something. Yeah, that's what I just did. I just switched on to Metapod. Metapod. Sack the Metapod? Dude, I'm get, uh, Metapod's just getting <coughs> tickled, man. Tickles my Metapod, attack and defense fell. Now I harden. You know, a little tickle action, a little harden action. You know? Mm -hmm. Does Caterpie get Bug Bite? Like, so. as a level up move? I've got the thing right here, so let's check. Butterfree. Butterfree gets Bug oh, Bite no. at level 1. Okay. Uh, please don't, please don't hit yourself. Please don't hit yourself. Please don't hit yourself. Alright, Bug Bite should kill. Bug Bite should kill. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Dude, Cat like, double confusion. That's ridiculous. Yo, did, did you sack the Butterfree? No, 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 no. Bug Bite killed. Okay, because that, your Butterfree, its level one moveset is Bug Bite, Gust, Harden, String Shot, and Tackle. So Bug Bite and Gust are like your only two. But it gets Confusion at level eight, and then level 12, it gets all the powder moves. It gets Poison, Sleep, yeah. and Stun Spore. Plus it's, and it's 16, level 17. And at 16, it gets Psy Beam. So you can go back and learn a lot. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, if I can keep it alive, it's going to be really good. I'm just trying to think, like, what to do here. I'm at a Hatena now. I don't have anything that's, like, my my move to hit you hard is a poison jab. Which, like, yeah, it's good, but, like, if you live it, like, you're living it. Yeah. Um, I think I tried some cheeky strats here, but this might end up getting me killed. I'm not, I'm kind of, like, all my Pokemon are just, like, half health right now. Are you battling beads? Uh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Am I? Where are you at? Uh, I'm passing. I'm in the. I'm oh, in the right. city. I'm about. To, I'm catching my Pokemon to surprise trade. But then again, come I'm on, still current. I'm also currently waiting on a surprise trade. Are I you might kidding me? I missed. I missed my sweet kiss. Ooh. Did you lose anything or no? No, but I'm about to lose my Cleffa. I mean, at least it's only Cleffa. Yeah, but I mean Clefable? True, true. And I can have Clefable, like, pretty soon. Dude, uh, what well, do I do it here? It depends. It's happiness. Cleffa's happiness. Yeah, well, it's not going to like me because I'm going to beat it into the ground and train it like a true trainer should and show it how freaking Pokemon fights. But then again, it ain't like this, that's for sure. If you get that Clefable, uh, if you get that Clefairy, you can go get the Moonstone that I just got and get a Clefable immediately. Yeah, exactly. That's why it's like, it's really solid to have when I can get it. But I just like, I don't know what to do right now, dude. I don't know, man. Like, every, like everything's weak. <laughs> I unfortunately do not have an answer for you on that. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm going to try sending out my Exazotu. I didn't want to battle you. All right. Exatu eats that pretty decently. Let Confuse Ray is going to hit this time, right? Yeah, Confuse Ray hits every time, except for 5% <coughs> of the time, which is usually the 5% that I need it to. But hit yourself, please. Yes, please, please, yes. Okay, sure, why not? Uh, round, that's gonna do... Ooh, that does a good chunk. That does a lot more than I needed it to do. Uh, is teleport... Teleport's not negative priority, is it? Uh, yes, it is. Yes, it is. It's negative six. Ooh, thank you. 
I almost just sacked my Exotia there. I don't know what to send out. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I don't know. It would be whatever you think is your worst mon. I don't want to lose anything. I don't want to have the first death either. Hit, hit yourself, please hit yourself. If you hit yourself, we kill. Okay, or or we just we just don't. No, we never hit ourselves in confusion. I might have to sack Metapod. Honestly, I think out of your team, I think that would be like the best to sack. Like it does. Like the best bet with Butterfree is those um is the spore moves, the status moves. Yeah, and but that like would help you can get some other cage match, but it would. But here's the thing, like, literally everything is half health or less right now. Yeah, so... Oh. Unless you hit... Unless unless it hits itself in confusion right here, but it hasn't it done it la... yet. It's gonna snap out right here. Is it its last no, one? please, please, please. Nope, it's dead. <coughs> What's dead? My Metapod. Metapod's dead. Ooh. Oh, I just got... Well, a... there you have it. Roki got the first death. I just got it. And I still don't know what I do. I still literally don't know what I do here. Because I don't know if a quick attack kills, and if a quick attack doesn't kill, I might die. Shit. Um. I've. I was gonna go out into Chudo and Bite, but I just, like, I don't. Because then that thing's gonna most likely die. Although it might have done a little bit more, but let's see. I don't know. I don't know. Dude, that does nothing. Can you hit yourself once, please? Dude, freaking frick me. By the way, I just got a Choodle. Dude. I did not see... What was I at? 27, 13. I'm at 14. Do I take the chance? Was It, it was a roll, dude. There's no way. You were at 27? Ooh, but keep mine crits. I don't yeah. know. It's up to you. Dude, no, I, I don't know what to do here. I think I have to sack a second mom. Who would you sack, though? Literally no idea. Choodle? If that's if that's who you think is your worst mom, then yeah. I mean, I think f worst, like, future, like, worst future mom, it's definitely, like, lowest on the tier. I mean, dude, Excadrill is literally, like, top tier. Exotu is going to be decent. Yeah. Clefable's pretty good. I'm not losing my reboot. I'm not gonna lie, that your scariest thing on your team for me right now, um, that I don't like is that Drillbur. Because Drillbur down the line is gonna oh, put yeah, in dude. work. Yeah, Excadrill's pretty cracked. But if I can't beat the first gauge, that's probably the first thing you take out. And it snaps out of confusion, uses confusion on me. Do we does it just kill here? And it confuses me, dude. <coughs> Jesus. I think I, I think I lose. Like I might just lose. Please don't hit yourself. Can bite kill? Please kill. Okay, bite kills. Okay. Who'd you bite? Holy with? crap, dude. Dude, I don't know, like, you probably can't tell, obviously, but, like, my hands are freaking soaked, dude. My cheeks oh, no, are I'm literally, sure. like, clenched to all tightness, dude. Like, you I couldn't Pokemon even fart right now if I wanted to. Do you still have another What's Pokemon that? to kill, or is that it? No, that's it, but, like, holy frick, dude. Yeah. You only lost rough. one. You only lost one, right? Yeah, I only lost one, but, dude, like, that was, like, my Chudo had, what, like, correct me if I'm wrong, less than 10 health, and I was confused. So I had to outspeed and break through confusion and kill with one, like a bite. Jesus. And And what? Hello? My metapod is evolving. <laughs> you know what? I'm just you know what? I'm just I'm I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Boy, goodbye. Goodbye, please. Come back. Baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. The pipes were great there. Nobody. Don't worry, me. I'm back. Oh, hang on. I now I have to reset all my stuff. There we go.
I'm back. Don't worry. I'm not leaving. I just got a mod I like a lot. Yeah. <coughs> this is salt. This is salt in the wound, man. Watching my dead Metapod freaking evolve. Oh, what do you want to learn? Gust? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. You know what? We're going to get rid of, um, uh, string shot. Yeah, that seems great. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll, we'll waste time doing this. If I wasn't salty at the fact that you got a Nido King, like, no pun intended there. If I wasn't salty at that, I'm a salty boy now. <laughs> uh, no, I'm sure, I'm sure, I'm sure. Dude, I lose my Metapod and then it evolves in front of my face. Like, when did they change that? I thought if it was dead, it didn't evolve. No, it's always it's always been that it'll evolve even if it's dead. Dude, I feel like that's maybe like a Gen 1, Gen 2 thing, but like, I swear at one point in time it wasn't. Uh, maybe. Server maintenance starting on Pokemon Sword. Hopefully that doesn't give us some issues. No, but if, if the servers don't come back up, we can't do our cage match. This is a very fair point. <laughs> this is a very fair point. Oh, wreck me. I dude. guess we'll find out you? afterwards. Uh, yeah, I guess so. I'm gonna Yo, try. You're at the town I... already, right? What should I name my impidimp? Uh, you should name it Dead. And you should just sack it off, like right now. I don't like that answer. I mean, I feel like you got an impidimp. Hold on, hold the phone. Yeah, it's it's literally what I just got. Okay, I'm 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 sorry, but like. Wow, freaking, why can't I remember? Grimmsnarl is probably, like, one of the best Pokemon in this game. Like, in this generation, at least. As far as, like, the generational Pokemon go. Oh my god, I just realized how how fitting my nickname was for what you suggested. What's that? I named him Grave Robber after the Yu-Gi-Oh card, because the Yu-Gi-Oh card, it kind of looks kind of like an Impidimp. Ooh. Even though Grave Robber obviously came first. Um, but you said to name yeah. it Dead, and I named it Grave Robber. Dude, that's it. that inspiration right there, dude. I'm an inspiring gent. What can I say? Shut up, Hop. I'm trying to heal my dead Pokemon. Yo, I like the music for this town. It's actually pretty, pretty bussin'. I named my Choodle Chew on this. What'd you name it? Chew on this. Chew on this. Yeah, I'm nicknaming all the Pokemon that like I can nickname that I didn't realize I could have. Um, I don't think I can nickname my Nido King, right? Yeah, it's an impeccable name. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I know. I hate that. Like, at least let me change it once. Like, bleh. Yo, I love how Reboot literally has just, like, a little sweatshirt, and he's got, like, his hands in, like, his hoodie pocket. Yeah. I guess such a cool design. Also, uh, we can go and get the Slowpoke at some point, too. Oh, the Glaring Slowpoke, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's something, too. Uh, why did I just go the whole way? I could have done this from here. Oh, I guess I was in the Pokemon Center anyway. Um, I need to take my Butterfree. Um, <sighs> Smetbo. You know, were, you were there to die. And I appreciate your death. Your sacrifice was not in vain because my Choodle died. So, yeah. I'm gonna nickname my... Choodle Sly Fox. You should I'm, name him like also so, dead, and then sorry. sack him off as well. Sorry, not my Choodle, my uh, my Nicket. Oh, you should name that also dead, and sack that also off. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm Deathless Run here. <laughs> Deathless Run here. I wish I could say <coughs> the same. So I'm going for. I'm going for the Deathless. Definitely going for the Deathless. Where are you at right now? Uh, me, I am, I'm in the city, I'm gonna go, uh, I already caught my encounter, and I've already gotten, ooh, I didn't even get my encounter there, I should probably do that instead of going and talking to, uh, what's her duty? Sonia? Sonia? Yeah, get Sonia. your encounter and start surprise trading it before you, uh, yeah. go talk to her. Yeah, I'm in I just didn't want to like battle. I didn't want to deal with any of these trainers. So I just was just like, nah. I just want to get out of here right now. Oh, go get go. Uh, or we could actually save the encounter for the next one. Cause it's 28 minutes. Frustrated? Yeah, we're at 28 mm. minutes, so we could wrap it up here. But I just ran into my encounter. All right, so grab your encounter first, and then we'll uh, wrap it up. I almost just yolo balled with a chew to win on a yamper. Can we talk about that? 
That would not have gone well for you. Dude, like, I, I probably would have cried, honestly. I love Tamper. Yo, yo, Yamper's tail whip is so cute, man. Yeah, it is. Oh my god, he just shakes his little lightning bolt, but. Alright. One, two, three. Yeah, there we go. Alrighty, beauty. All right. All right. Yep. So we're going to save it. that surprise trade for the next episode, guys. In the next episode, we probably will start taking on the gym. So, uh, yeah, we're probably going to start taking on the gym in the next episode. I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. Uh, Roki, you got any final words? Uh, no. Hope everybody enjoyed. Make sure that you are subscribed to Slightly Salty. Don't forget that. Also, make sure you're sub to Roki because the next episode is going to be on his channel. That's it for this one, guys. Hope you guys enjoy. And as always, stay salty.